everyone and welcome back to my heavenly babies my name is angel and i am back today for my share a daughter saturday which i host here on my channel and look who i'm sharing my beautiful new baby girl nevea this is the kimberly sculpt uh real born bountiful babies i got her off of reborns.com from amanda schwartzman and I just absolutely love this little girl. This was my dream vinyl, and I'm so happy to have her. And we're going to do a little spotlight on her today, get her in a cute outfit. I have pierced her ears, and I have not yet put the magnet in, but we're just having a passy there for um, the looks. But she is so gorgeous, you guys. I'm loving her so much. She's got the most beautiful paint job and done exactly the way I would have wanted a Kimberly done. She's just stunning. One day I may add hair, have hair added to her, um, the color of her lashes, which is kind of a light brown, and her eyebrows, uh, which were painted. Um, I might eventually do that, have hair done, but right now she's got the beautiful veining. I love the indent in her head and all that, so she's okay being a baldy. But yeah, we're going to get her in a cute outfit today and talk about her and how I feel about her since I got her. We're going to go ahead and do our devotional, Billy Graham Wisdom for Each Day. And today we are on November 11th. And this one's called to, Depending on the Truth. This is a testimony. God has given us eternal life. And this life is in his son. He who has the son has life. 1 John 5, 11 through 12. Then it goes on to say, I imagine that you had a wealthy, re I imagine that you had a wealthy relative and one day her attorney called to tell you she had died and left you millions of dollars. The money he added was now deposited in a bank in your name and you could draw on it any time. What would you do? Would you say, oh, well, it can't be true. I'll just forget about this call. I doubt it. Instead, you act on it, accepting by faith that what the attorney had told you was true and you were now a millionaire and what a difference it would make. In a far greater way, God offers us a gift, the gift of salvation in Jesus Christ. Christ alone done everything possible to provide it for you. All you must do is receive it. Have you taken that step and by faith received Christ in your life? But God's generosity doesn't end there. God wants you to draw upon his riches every day, the riches of his wisdom, strength, truth, and presence. Don't like, don't live like a spiritual um, pomper any longer. You know, I love this, you guys, because, you know, talking about like if somebody called you and told you, you know, you just became a millionaire because somebody in the family left you money that you never knew you were going to have and how things in your life would change so much. But money will never make you truly happy. You know, it's, it's, it's great to have to pay bills and stuff like that, but Money is the root of all evil. It is great to have, to pay off bills, to do things that you need to do. But sometimes money can pull you from God. But think about the gift of eternal life. That gift is a gift that cannot compare to anything in the whole world because none of these things we get to take with us. So it doesn't matter how much money you have. We take none of that with us. But to have that, know that you can have eternal life in heaven, that salvation, that that you know guarantee that heaven is yours is a far greater gift than anything in the world because no matter how happy money can bring or it seems like it brings and all of that, it doesn't truly bring true happiness. But knowing where you're going is a much greater gift. You know, when I was looking up today, I was just, um, Patrick Swayze's story came up. You know, Patrick Swayze passed away, rest in peace, um, of that um, pancreatic cancer. And um, Michael Landon did too. And it was reading both stories it kind of hit me like uh patrick swayze fought for his life and all that but never once said the things that michael landon did michael landon said i'm not afraid to die because i know where i'm going and that's what we need to know in our hearts to know where we're going to not fear death because you don't truly die your shell that carried you goes under the ground but your soul lives on forever in heaven for eternity and so that's why michael landon wasn't afraid of death he said I don't want to die, but at the same time, I'm not afraid to die. Where Patrick Swayze, um, he didn't, I wouldn't say he was, said he was afraid to die, but it was sad that he was dying and he fought for his life and all that. I don't know what his walk with God was like, but just to know how Michael Landon said it, that he wasn't afraid of death because 
we don't truly die. So it's important to think about that gift, that gift that no money in the world could ever compare to such a gift of salvation in heaven, where you wouldn't have to worry anymore where you're, you know, what's going to happen when you die or worry about death and all that, because we get to go to heaven and then there's no more hurt or pain or sorrow or, you know, all the lies and deceit that happens here on earth, which is not our permanent home. Our permanent home is in heaven if you want it. So I really enjoyed this one, depending on the truth. That really was a great one to read today. And it really made me think, you know, it does. It makes me think that nothing in the world could ever compare to that salvation that I have in Jesus Christ. I'm thankful for his death. Wisdom for today. There are many, Lord, who have placed their faith in you for salvation and yet are missing out on the blessings available to them in here and now. Thank you that our hope is not just for eternal life, but for our present life as well. Amen to that. What great wisdom for today. You know, we have just so much to look forward to, you guys. We really do. And it's important to always remember to start your day, go through your day, and end your day with Life's Manual, the Holy Bible. Read it, study it, honor, obey, and live by it, you guys. God wants us to read his love story. Beautiful things like that are going to be, you know, read to us, or we're going to hear it if you have an app. And it's just wonderful to know that we don't have to worry. You know, all these things we have, I'm so grateful to have a Kimberly. It was one of my dream babies. But Kimberly, you know, my Nevea isn't coming with me when I die. These are just materialistic items. But it's nice here on earth to have that. But it's also extremely nice and wonderful that I have my salvation. I love that more than anything I own, more than anything in the world. And then, of course, God and then my family, my husband, my children, you know, all come above all of these materialistic things. But let's get right today. Pick up your word and read it. Get in the habit of reading, you guys. Read God's word because it surely will make you feel better. I was dealing with a little bit of depression today, as I still do. As You know, I'm human. We all do. But as I read God's word, again, it just helps you to feel better. The devil wants to still kill and destroy and hurt you every way he can. So cause depression and anxiety and, you know, make you worry about money and finances and all that. And God says, don't worry. Put it in me. Let go and let God. That is a wonderful saying. Let go and let God. Let God deal with it. So just reading has made me feel much better right now, you know, and I'm, I'm very happy about that. So thank you, God, for that. All right, you guys, I hope you enjoyed the reading today. And um, that was on Depending on the Truth. So depending on the truth, you know, and Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life. And it's ours if we want it. All right, let's get on to my beautiful Nevaeh. We're going to change her. And like I said, I really, really love her. I love her skin tone. If you could just see her in person, you would just be blown away. This peachy color. She's a peaches and cream and more to the pinky peach. She's just stunning. Absolutely stunning. Her nail beds, her toes, everything is so beautiful. Her veining. I love her. I couldn't have found a more perfect Kimberly. And um, we are, you know, enjoying her so much. And I think... Um, Amanda so much for her and I've got one more coming a birthday baby through her I'm excited about and um, I probably will be opening it early um, but just waiting for a few things and then you know we'll, we'll discuss that when that comes but I'm getting one more through her for a birthday baby and then one more I'm getting which is a surprise um, for kind of slash birthday Christmas so yeah I'm just excited to finally own a Kimberly boy I got teared up after I shut that video off and I was just staring at her She's so lovely and beautiful. Yes, you are, little girl. Snuggled her that night. She laid with me. So we're going to take her little pacifier. And let me show you the outfit first. We're going to put this beautiful sleeper on her. Isn't this gorgeous? This one, you know, one-piece sleeper. It, the buttons go off to the side, and it's a cream color. But the um, little, like, uh, bows on it in a satin are done in white. And then it's got ruffle all the way down and ruffle around the collar and around the sleeves. And then the bottom are just, you know, got the feet in it. And it's, like I said, a creamish white. And it's got these beautiful uh, pink roses with greenery through it. It's called Little Me. This is a three-month, but she does wear zero to three. We're going to pair it with this beautiful peachy pink rose headband for her since she's bald. And then we're just going to put these little uh, white socks on her. And then we'll just have this as a prop, the little uh, pink, um, you know, uh, pacifier that I will be modifying her mouth. All right, let's go ahead and take her little bear as she sleeps. This bear says, thank heaven for little girls. Yes, and thank heaven for little boys too. 
I love that she came with this bracelet. Um, Amanda was saying she did the bracelet for something gold since it was an angel opening that she said she'd like something gold as we will walk the streets of gold one day. And I just thought that was neat. And on here, I will have Nevea put on there. I'm going to have it, um, uh, you know, done on there where you have it. <laughs> Boy, I just lost the train of thought. Um, I can't even think of it, but I'm going to have her name put on there. <laughs> So she's got the onesie on. We I went ahead and did a onesie on her in a, in a diaper. So we're going to go ahead and put this on her and we'll just talk. How's everybody doing this fine Saturday? I hope you guys are having a nice weekend. Always nice for the weekends to come, especially if you don't have to work, right? Then the weekends are even better. So yeah, but I pre-record all these videos. So today is actually Friday for me, a day before. Um, I had a lot of videos um, already done, so I have to get caught up on some. So I'm going to make a, a bunch of them in a row here on the same day. I pre-record all of them. Uh, speaking of that, um, little uh, Nola, Nolan sold immediately, you guys, literally five minutes after I put them up. I also put uh, my babies up on Facebook Market, and I put them up on um, uh, a site I'm on, on Facebook and Facebook. So I put them up on there, and um, within five minutes, I had somebody contact me from um, uh, Facebook Market, and they said... Um, I have been looking, I'm a collector, a doll collector for a few years, three or four years. And I've been looking for that, that, you know, doll that would look realistic in a budget way. And she goes, I think I found him. Could we meet the next day? Cause this was in the evening. And so I met her the next day, madly in love and, um, got him right away. She even gave me a tip. Thank you so much for that. I, she is sub to my channel now, so I'm not sure if she's watching, but thank you so much. I think it was Alexis was her name. She actually messaged me today and said she had a wonderful night with Nolan. And she is keeping the name Nolan. A wonderful night with Nolan. And she is so happy to have him. And he's so beautiful. She actually mes messaged me today that. Um, so uh, I can even show you guys that message so you guys know. Again, it is so hard when buying babies because it can be very scary. We have a lot of scammers out there. Look at how cute this is on her. Aw, so pretty with the ruffles. Yes, but yes, it can be very scary, you guys, to order babies. It really can because you just don't know who to trust. But you can trust me. I can give you safety photos. Um, I do have a baby for sale. I'm going to put it up on the side there. That's Brock. He's still waiting to find a good mommy or daddy to be adopted out. He's available at 450 plus shipping. A wonderful price for him, and that's what I wanted to go over. Um, is not only can I give you safety photos, I can give you references, ref, references, and all of that. And um, my babies are going to go up after December 25th. I'm doing this just for the holidays right now. You guys, they're going to go up a hundred, between 50 to 100 dollars on each baby because. Um, a lot of you probably don't even realize what I put into these babies. Now, just an example of Nolan. I had 70 hours invested in that baby, okay? So you have to think of my time, the cost of the baby, okay? The cost of the supplies I use for the paints. I use very expensive, look it up, Fuse FX, um, and it's called the baby kit. Look that up and see. The cheapest I can find it is 160 plus tax, but normally it's around two to 250 for that. Um, the silicone velvet, and I have to buy in bulk. I have to buy bigger. Look that up. Look up the Fuse FX 110 Part A, and I get the bigger one because I need that to do babies. It only does about 10 babies. Look how expensive that is. That's over 100 for that. The silicone velvet's over 100 The other one is between 160 and 250 All right, then you got to think of the hair I have to buy for the babies. The one I'm selling has the eyes in that baby, and they are irresistible. They are over $20 a pair. They're $17.99 plus tax. It's over $20 for those, those eyes. Um, the Like I said, the rooting, I have to get the needles. Needles break. You have to get the needles to do it. Like the all the supplies to paint, the brushes and all that. I got to keep getting brushes. You have to get sponges for painting and you have to make sure that they're a non-latex. You have to get latex gloves when you're working with it. You have to have, you know, every once in a while buy new little tweezers because you got to be picking off all the little hairs and stuff as much as you can while you're painting because it's sticky. And I double seal my baby. So think about all of that. And then I send this baby with over between a 50 to over a $50 uh, box opening. Think about all of that, guys, what I'm putting into these babies. If you add all that together, I'm literally making nothing off of these babies. And as soon as I sell one, I got to immediately buy one again with that money again and supplies and things I need. So I've got to make a little bit more profit for myself. And like Brock, I've got 80 hours invested into him. You know, he was longer. He's bigger, more hair. So it took longer to do him. 
So just think about that and understand. And I'm still going to be a budget baby, though, because these babies that I'm buying and selling, you can find them on, and I've said it many times, on Etsy. They buy these babies with the factory paint, and all they do is they're either powdering them or they're sealing them. Uh, just a quick seal, and then they're doing maybe rooting eyelashes and selling it bald with just one little outfit and a blanket. That's it, and they're asking between seven and a thousand. I've showed you guys that many times. I'll throw a few photos up right now again and show you that. There's one on a Facebook market right now. Nothing done to that baby. No paint, no seal. He's shiny, everything. They're asking a thousand dollars for it, and people are buying these babies because they're a wonderful silicone. Whether they be a budget baby, you know, uh, copies or whatever they are, they still are a a wonderful, fabulous silicone. They're almost better than the $3,000 silicones. They are floppy and squishy and wonderful babies. So they really are great. And like I said, I don't ever want to be too ridiculous, but I'm going to be going between um, between five fifty and six hundred for my babies, or between five and six hundred is what my babies are going to be right now. They're between three and uh, four fifty, but I'm going to be going to five to six hundred for my babies after December twenty fifth. So jump on that. Also, I wanted to mention that I do custom right now. If there's people out there they wanted a Levi really bad, they wanted that one, and as soon as I put one up, it went right away, and people were disappointed. Contact me. Here's my email. I'll throw it up on the screen. Contact me. I will do a uh, custom for you. Then you can tell me what color hair you want and kind of how you want that baby done. You know, it's somewhat custom or whatever. And I'm um, at a great budget price right now. Um, be, I mean, before my prices go up, they're still going to be great. But before they go up, if you want a Levi for the holidays, let me know, you guys. Uh, the other lady, Shannon, that watches me, she wants an open eye girl. Shannon, if you want that, get a hold of me and we can talk and I can get that done for you right away. I can do that for you. Now, if you guys need these customs, I do need a down payment, though. I do need $150 down for me to buy the baby and start working on it. That is a non-refundable deposit and that will be added to the, the money for buying the rest of the baby, then you'll have a difference when the baby's done, then you will pay the balance and the shipping and I'll get that baby shipped right out to you. But like I said, I can give you references and I can give you safety photos, anything you need or want. But if you want a custom, get a hold of me right now. The holidays are coming and I don't have any custom. Well, I've got the one. I'm doing one custom Levi right now for the end of the month, but I have room right now, time in between. If you need one done, let me know. All of that, counting the shipping, the baby to me and and getting it done and getting it home to you will be between two and three weeks. You'd have that baby. So let me know if you're interested in a custom Levi or like Shannon, you want that baby with the open eye and the baby fine hair for a girl. Let me know. Um, and yeah, I just wanted to mention all that with you guys. And other than that, beautiful Nevea is going to give you a kiss goodbye. Mwah. She loves mommy and daddy, of course, God. She loves all her aunties and uncles, grandmas and grandpas out there, and all of her cousins. And I'm enjoying her very much. Thank you again, Amanda. Every, and I love you guys. Mwah. But remember, remember, remember what? God loves you the most, and he wants you to get that uh, salvation. So you have eternal life in heaven. He wants everybody to have heaven. That's why he came to the sin-infested world as Jesus is, you know, God's son, Jesus Jesus Christ died on a cross for us at the age of 33 so that we could have eternal life if we wanted it. It's a free gift. Nothing better than that. No money in the world, no doll, no purchase, no thing. No, anything you have will never compare to your salvation and knowing where you're going when your time is up. All right, you guys, everybody take care. God bless, and I'll see each and every one of you in my very next upload. Thank you.